네, 오늘은 구매를 한 것을 후회하는 mm -hmm. 경험에 대해서 누가 이야기를 해 줄까요? Today we have a clip sent to us from Richard from the USA. 네. My friend Richard. 미국에 살고 있는 리처드 씨에게 이야기를 들어보겠습니다. 자, 그럼 바로 불러 볼까요? 리처드 씨? 나와 주세요. A purchase that I regret making happened actually while Steph and I were living in Korea. And this is also a story I've never shared publicly with anyone until now. We were thinking about making some documentary movies. At least I was thinking about it. Steph was going to support me. So I was looking at purchasing equipment, camera equipment, basically prosumer cameras, not professional, not consumer, but the middle of the road type cameras to make really high quality videos to upload to the internet. This was back in very late 2010. I ended up finding this one website that had less expensive prices than any of the other websites I was looking on. So I decided to make my purchase there. I was buying three cameras and long story short, I made the purchase and the website stole my money. Thousands and thousands of dollars. <laughs> I don't want to say the exact amount, but literally millions of Korean won. And it was a really, really big blow at the time because it was my first really big purchase getting into making videos. And it's so funny looking back at it now. It really stung for several days. Oh my, yes. she lost thousands and thousands of dollars? Yeah, it was, uh, it must have been a big blow. Yes, for sure a big blow. 네, 그래서 굉장히 괴로웠을 것 같은데 지금 처음으로 공개적으로 이런 이야기를 하는 거라고 해요. 자, 그럼 yeah. 구체적으로 어떤 일이 생겼는지 이거는 뭐 구매를 한걸 후회한 게 아니고 구매를 못 했네요. Yeah, 돈만 because 보내고. it wasn't a real website. 음. So anyway, let's take a look at what he said line by line. The first line is a purchase that I regret making happened. A purchase that I regret making happened. 네, regret 전에도 소개한 적이 있지만 regret 뒤에는 ing를 붙여서 이제 전에 했다 한 것을 가리킵니다. 음. 그래서 과거의 의미를 가지고 있어요. ing 이 부분이요. 그래서 제가 a purchase, 어떤 구매 행위죠. Mm -hmm. That I regret making. Make a purchase가 원래 이제 굳어져, mm -hmm. 굳어져 있는 표현이잖아요. Mm -hmm. 이제 그 purchase가 앞으로 갔죠. Mm -hmm. A purchase that I regret making happened. 제가 구매를 후회한 것은 언제 있었죠? Right. Happened actually while Steph and I were living in Korea. Mm -hmm. Actually while Steph and I were living in Korea. Steph is his wife. His wife. 네, Short for Stephanie. 네, Stephanie가 이제 Steph로 줄여서 mm -hmm. 이렇게 표현되고 있는데 Steph and I 하면서 Steph. So in future videos, in the future clips that we will receive from Richard, we will probably hear the name Steph. Steph, yeah. Sometimes. Steph and I or me and Steph. Yeah. Mm. Steph가 이제 아내 이름이니까 나오고 있고 while Steph and I were living in Korea 사실 스태프와 제가 한국에 살고 있을 때였어요. Mm -hmm. Okay, so Okay. More about it. And this is also a story I've never shared publicly with anyone until now. And this is also a story I've never shared publicly with anyone until now. 또한 this is also a story 어떤 이야기인데 I've never shared 한 번도 공개한 적이 없는, 공유한 적이 없는, 다른 사람들에게 나눈 적이 없는 이야기예요. Mm -hmm. Publicly, 공개적으로는 한 번도 말을 안 했대요. Mm -hmm. Maybe he told his wife. Yep. You But have to. Definitely never announced it, you know, to us, to a lot of people. Yes. Right? With anyone, shared with anyone, mm -hmm. right? 누군가 누구하고도 이제 나누지 않았던 이야기인데 mm -hmm. until now. Until this very moment. moment. 지금 이 순간까지도 비밀로 거의 했던 거죠. Mm. Okay, let's find okay. out. Okay. We were thinking about making some documentary movies. We were thinking about making some documentary movies. 저희는 다큐멘터리 영화를 만드는 것에 대해서 생각하고 있었습니다. Mm -hmm. We were thinking about doing that. Mm -hmm. 똑같죠. 생각하고 있었다는 것은 할까 말까. 이렇게 yeah. 하면 어떨까. Mm -hmm. You're contemplating on Contemplating. That. But usually if we say we were thinking about it, Probably you're more on the you're probably going to do it side, yeah, yeah. right? 음, 그렇죠. Yeah. 어, 이제 계획까지도 거의 세우고 있었겠죠. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. At least I was thinking about it. Steph was going to support me. Mm -hmm. At least I was thinking about it. Steph was going to support me. 여기서 최소한이라는 at least가 왜 나왔냐면 바로 앞 문장에서 mm -hmm. we were going to right. well, we were thinking about making documentary movies mm -hmm. 했는데 우리 둘다 생각한 건 아니었고 at least I. Right. right. It was just me. She just knew about it. 맞아요. She was going to support me. 맞아요. 그래서 우리 둘이 같이 아 최소한 저만큼은 yeah. 이제 리차드 씨가 먼저 생각을 해냈겠죠. 그래서 mm -hmm. 최소한 
I was thinking about it. 저는 생각을 하고 있었고, Steph, his wife, was going to support me. Mm-hmm. Steph는 제가 하는 것을 지지해 주려고 했어요. 이 support는 여러 가지로 생각할 수 있어요. Mm-hmm. Maybe if Richard wasn't working, maybe if she had to work, right. she well, would support him. Right, support him like that, or just support as in give encouragement to. Mm. Like, yeah, you know, go for it, do 맞아요. it. You know, you can, you can buy these things you need. Yeah. 이거는 문맥상 정보가 더 있어야만 알수 있겠는데, right. support me 한다는 게 정말로 어, 재정적으로 mm-hmm. 지원을 해주는 건지 mm-hmm. 아니면 할수 있어, 뭐 찬성이야 yeah. 하고 그냥 심리적으로, 정서적으로 mm-hmm. 좀 지지해주는 건지는 이 문장만 보고는 알 수가 없습니다. Right. Next he says, So I was looking at purchasing equipment, camera equipment. So I was looking at purchasing equipment, camera equipment. Interesting expression here. He was looking at, mm-hmm. he wasn't looking at equipment, 장비를 no. 보고 있는 게 아니고 looking at purchasing, purchasing equipment. 사실 purchasing은 행동이잖아요. Yeah. It's an action. Right. So when we say looking at an action, we don't mean actually looking at it. You can't really look. You can look at someone doing it, mm-hmm. but you can't look at it. So we mean thinking about it, looking into it. So researching. Oh, what mm-hmm. equipment should I get? 맞아요. You know, putting in the actions you need to actually buy it. 그렇죠. 그래서 제가 번역에 넣은 것처럼 알아보고 있었던 거죠. Mm-hmm. He was looking into it, 또는 he was thinking about it. Mm-hmm. 그래서 looking at. Mm-hmm. We use that with a lot of things, especially university. You don't know which one you're going to go to, so um, I'm looking at universities right now, 음. like seeing the different ones, 아, 그렇죠. researching, right? 네, 연구, 조사를 해보는 거죠. Mm-hmm. Looking at purchasing equipment, camera equipment. 참고로 equipment은 세지 않습니다. Mm-hmm. You don't ever say one equipment. Equipment, no. You just, just have to specify. Yeah, just equipment. Right, that piece of equipment 맞아요. or whatever. 비슷한 게 이제 가구죠. Furniture mm-hmm. 하고 equipment는 세지 않고 right. a piece, piece of, of furniture, furniture or a piece of equipment. Okay, mm-hmm. let's move on. All right. Basically, prosumer cameras. Basically, prosumer cameras. 기본적으로 prosumer 카메라들을 살려고 알아보고 있었는데 이게 mm-hmm. 뭔지는 또 이야기가 나옵니다. Mm-hmm. Not professional, not consumer, but the middle of the road type cameras. <웃음> not professional, not consumer, but the middle of the road type cameras. Not professional, 전문적이라고 하면 정말 좀 커지고 예산도 많이 올라가게 right. 되는데 Not consumer, 그런데 또 일반 소비자용은 아닌 right. Not consumer, 소비자는 아닌이 아니고 소비자용은 아닌 Right, so that, not just for basic use, like he wants to move into the professional realm. Yes, right? so not professional cameras. And not consumer cameras, mm-hmm. but the middle, middle of the road road. type cameras. Mm-hmm. 딱 느낌이 오시죠? Middle of the road라는 것은 yeah. 도로의 중간에 만난다. Yeah, so there's consumer, just a basic camera. There's professional, you're in the middle. Mm. Better than the normal ones, but not as good as the professional ones. 맞아요. 그래서 중간 수준의 카메라들을 이렇게 표현해 주고 있어요. Mm-hmm. 굉장히 재밌는 표현이죠. Middle of the road. Yeah. 네. Middle of the road type cameras. Uh-huh. Let's move on. To make really high quality videos to upload to the internet. Mm-hmm. To make really high quality videos to upload to the internet. 네, 무엇을 하기 위해서 또는 무엇을 할 카메라 mm-hmm. really high quality, 어, 아주 고 퀄리티의 비디오들을 만들기 위해서 mm-hmm. 무엇을 하기 위한 비디오냐면 to upload to the internet. 인터넷에 올릴 비디오들이죠. Mm-hmm. All right. All right. This was back in very late 2010. This was back in very late 2010. 이게 언제 있었던 일인지 구체적으로 말하고 있는 문장입니다. This mm-hmm. was in 2010 해도 되는데 mm-hmm. This was in 2010. 지금보다 과거의 일이니까 Right. He says Back in. Mm-hmm. Back in. 고등학교 다닐 때 Back in high school. Yeah. Back when I was a kid. You could say it like that as well. 네. 지금으로부터 You travel back in time. Yeah. <웃음> 그래서 This was back in 2010, 그런데 very late 2010. Late. So when is very late 2010? It's the last few months. Mm. The last few months. Maybe so maybe October, October November, yeah. December? 그 yeah. 3개월 중에 하나겠죠? Because they said very late. Yeah. So that's the last three months. September는 좀 아니고, October부터 아마 12월까지. Right. So what happened? I ended up finding this one website that had less expensive prices. Mm-hmm. I ended up finding this one website that had less expensive prices. 뭐뭐를 한 끝에 결과적으로 이렇게 하게 됐다. 그게 mm-hmm. 바로 end up doing something이죠. Mm-hmm. So I ended up finding. 막 찾다가 mm-hmm. he was looking at. Right, he was looking into cameras mm-hmm. and he ended up finding a website 
to buy those cameras. 네, 그래서 looking at purchasing 하다가 어, oh, oh, I oh. ended up finding yeah. this one website. 여기서 마찬가지로 이제 this 딱 가리키고 있는 건 아니고 머릿속에 그림이 right. 있죠. Mm-hmm. One website that had less expensive prices. Mm. 다른 곳보다 더 가격이 낮은 어떤 웹사이트를 발견했어요. Mm-hmm. Which is great when you're looking for or when you're looking at buying something, you want the lowest price right. possible. Yeah, when you're looking at buying something, you're always looking for the lowest price. Yes, yeah, so he <laughs> must have been very excited of course. and happy. But, so let's continue the story. In the next sentence, let's watch the clip. Than any of the other websites I was looking on. Than any of the other websites I was looking on. Wow. Okay, so that was quite fast. So let's take a look at it together. Than any of the other websites I was looking on. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Than any of the other. 이 부분이 쭉 연음이 됐어요. Right. Than any of the other. Than any of the other. Mm-hmm. Than any of the other. Than any of the, the other. other. 여러분도 한번 큰 소리로 몇번 해보세요. Than any of the other. 물론 than any website 해도 돼요. Yeah. Mm. And you can understand. But, you know, he just wanted to add in any than the other. 네. 웹사이트를 여러 군데를 봤을 텐데 이곳이 the other website 중에서 그 어떤 그 any website 보다도 가격이 낮았다라는 것은 right. 가장 낮았던 거죠. the lowest mm-hmm. or the least expensive mm-hmm. prices. 그리고 I was looking on 했는데 why does he have on at the end here? Ah, because when you're looking at a web page you're looking on a site. Mm. Oh, right now I'm looking on this, you know, Korea site mm-hmm. about Korean culture. 네. <웃음> 그래서 그 웹사이트에 방문해 있을 때 yeah. you are online. Yeah. You're online. You're on this page. And you're looking on it. Mm. You're visiting it, right? 네. You're on it. 보통 실제로 물리적으로 어떤 장소로 갈 때에는 when you actually physically visit a place, you are at a place right. or you are in a place. Mm-hmm. 그런데 인터넷상에서 접속하는 것 자체가 you go online. On 접속 자체를 on으로 표현하다 보니까 mm-hmm. 웹사이트에 나 지금 너의 블로그를 방문 중이야. Mm-hmm. 친구한테 I'm on your blog now. Oh yeah. And you can, that's why you log on to certain sites and services as well. 그렇죠. Right. Log on 하면 은 접속하는 거죠. Right. 오케이. Okay. 이 부분 다시 들어보겠습니다. Than any of the other websites I was looking on. Than any of the other websites I was looking on. So he said it was cheap. So I decided to make my purchase there. I was buying three cameras. So I decided to make my purchase there. I was buying three cameras. 네, 다시 한번 make a purchase. purchase 라는 right. 표현이 쓰이고 있죠. Mm-hmm. Make a purchase. 그 우리 말로는 구매를 하다, mm-hmm. 환불을 하다, 전부 다 mm-hmm. 하다, 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 하다. All right. 인데 영어에서는 그 하다가 do가 아닌 경우가 많아요. Mm-hmm. Do you ever say do a purchase? No, you never say do a purchase. Always make or just purchase without mm-hmm. any of it. Yeah. 맞아요, 맞아요. 물론 purchase는 그런 경우라면 동사죠. Mm-hmm. You purchase oh, an true. item, purchase books, purchase a camera. Mm-hmm. 그거는 이제 동사고 make a purchase. Mm-hmm. 그 비슷한 것들이 이제 돈과 관련된 것들이 많은 것 같아요. Mm-hmm. 구매할 때 you make a purchase, mm-hmm. you make a reservation. Mm-hmm. What else? You make a transaction. Oh yeah, make a transaction. Inclu- and... Like related to money. Yeah. Make a transfer. Oh, I was just about to say that. <웃음> 네. You always say all the good ones. 송금할 때. Yeah. 이렇게 다 make, 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 mm-hmm. make. 만들다, 만들다가 아닌 거죠. 하다, 하다, 하다. Mm-hmm. All right, please remember that. Mm-hmm. 그리고 카메라를 세개 구입할 계획이었습니다. Mm-hmm. And long story short, I made the purchase and the website stole my money. Oh no. And long story short, I made the purchase and the website stole my money. 일단 made the purchase, 그 long story short, 요약해서 말하자면 구매를 했고요. The website stole my money. 음. 웹사이트가 돈을 훔쳐갔다. 카메라 세 대니까 금방 계산이 되시죠. Mm-hmm. 아무리 싼 거여도 금방 돈이 많아질 텐데 mm-hmm. 그 금액에 대해서 뒤에 나오고 있죠. Thousands and thousands of dollars. Thousands and thousands of dollars. This is the same as just thousands of dollars. Thousands of dollars, right. But when we want to emphasize, we say thousands and thousands of dollars. 네. Hundreds and hundreds of dollars. 네. 그냥 예를 들어서 mm-hmm. 사람들이 수백 명 있다 하면 은 mm-hmm. 
hundreds and hundreds of people? Yeah, hundreds okay. and hundreds of people. I was like, let me make sure I heard that correctly in Korean. Yeah, you're a good translator. <웃음> 굉장히 통역 잘할 것 같죠? <웃음> 근데 hundreds of people 해도 충분한데 hundreds and, and hundreds, hundreds of people. Mm-hmm. 근데 주의하셔야 될 것은 mm-hmm. 이런 경우도 있어요. hundreds and thousands of people라고 말하는 사람도 있잖아요. Oh yeah, 약간 수백 명, 수천 명그 경계가 모호할 때 right. 말하는데 실수로 hundreds of thousands, thousands. of 하면은 이제 완전히 그 스케일이 달라지죠. Right. 갑자기 수십만이 되는 거예요. Right, right, right. All right. Yeah, be careful. Yes, make sure you be careful. <웃음> All right, next one. I don't want to say the exact amount, but literally millions of Korean won. Mm. I don't want to say the exact amount, but literally millions and millions of Korean won. 네. I added that. 네, 중간에 <웃음> 추가를 했고요. 정확한 금액은 I don't want to say the exact amount. 정확한 yeah. 금액을 말하고 싶지 않지만 한국 돈으로 수백만 원이었어요. <웃음> 말 그대로 literally millions of Korean won. Oh no. Next sentence. And it was a really, really big blow at the time. Mm-hmm. And it was a really, really big blow at the time. Blow라는 것은 바람이 부는 것도 blow. The wind right. blows from the east. But a blow could also be a hit. 맞아요. So if I punched you, you received my blow. Mm-hmm. <웃음> 그래서 어떤 일이 충격으로 다가왔을 때 yeah. 또는 굉장히 창피한 일. It's mm-hmm. a big blow. Blow, yeah. yeah. Or really sad news, or like if you got fired, that's a big blow. Mm. Or if something is expensive, sometimes you can say it was a big blow mm. to your wallet. Ah, 아, 그렇죠. <laughs> yeah. 네. So if you say it was a big blow, in certain contexts, we understand ah to the wallet. Yes. 뭐 지갑이나 통장 잔고가 크게 타격을 입겠죠. Yeah. Blow가 되겠고요. Mm-hmm. 다음 문장. Because. It was my first really big purchase getting into making videos because it was my first really big purchase getting into making videos. 비디오를 만드는 데 있어서 또는 뭐 비디오를 만들기 시작하면서 처음으로 큰 돈을 써서 구매를 한 거였기 때문에 mm. it was a big blow. 나중에 yeah. 정말 조심스러웠을 것 같고요. Right. 마지막 문장. And it's so funny looking back on it now. It really stung for several days. And it's so funny looking back on it now. It really, uh, it really stung for several days. 지금 생각해 보면 웃긴데, mm-hmm. it's funny looking back on it now. It really stung for several days. Mm. Sting의 과거 형태가 쓰이고 mm-hmm. 있어요. Stung. Stung. Mm. Yeah. Sting. So if you receive a blow, it usually stings, mm-hmm. right? You got hurt. Ah, oh, it's the same. 쓰리다라고 할 때, mm-hmm. stings. 뭔가 stings. 벌에 쏘인 것처럼 yeah. stings. It stung mm-hmm. for several days. 여기서는 물론 실제 어디 다친 것은 아니고 마음이 아팠겠죠? Yep. All right, that okay. concludes the story, and we're going to review the whole thing, right? Yes, we're going to review it two more times. Let's watch. A purchase that I regret making happened actually while Steph and I were living in Korea, and this is also a story I've never shared publicly with anyone until now. We were thinking about making some documentary movies. At least I was thinking about it. Steph was going to support me. So I was looking at purchasing equipment, camera equipment, basically prosumer cameras, not professional, not consumer, but the middle of the road type cameras to make really high quality videos to upload to the internet. This was back in very late 2010. I ended up finding this one website that had less expensive prices than any of the other websites I was looking on. So I decided to make my purchase there. I was buying three cameras and long story short, I made the purchase and the website stole my money. Thousands and thousands of dollars. I don't want to say the exact amount, but literally millions of Korean won. And it was a really, really big blow at the time because it was my first really big purchase getting into making videos. And it's so funny looking back at it now. It really stung for several days. A purchase that I regret making happened actually while Steph and I were living in Korea. And this is also a story I've never shared publicly with anyone until now. We were thinking about making some documentary movies. At least I was thinking about it. Steph was going to support me. So I was looking at purchasing equipment, camera equipment, basically prosumer cameras, not professional, not consumer, but the middle of the road type cameras to make really high quality videos to upload to the internet. This was back in very late 2010. I ended up finding this one website that had less expensive prices than any of the other websites I was looking on. So I decided to make my purchase there. I was buying three cameras and long story short, I made the purchase and the website stole my money. Thousands and thousands of dollars. (laughs) 
I don't want to say the exact amount, but literally millions of Korean won. And it was a really, really big blow at the time because it was my first really big purchase getting into making videos. And it's so funny looking back at it now. It really stung for several days. Okay, thanks so much for that, and let's move right into Street Smart. Smart.